Here's our practical life lesson on tying. We are using the traditional Montessori tying frame. The tying frame that we'll be using, we got from Montessori Education Supplies. And here is how you will teach tying. And trust me, it's very long and a little bit tedious to watch, but it's really successful. It's been used in classrooms for years and years and years, and I know I personally have taught many children who've been struggling to tie their shoes. I've presented this lesson online in the classroom, and by the end of the day, many of them left learning how to tie their shoes. Here's the lesson. That is a lesson that has lots of very specific steps in it and the importance of each step, and you'll have to probably watch the video a few times, is because your child is going to be just 
you know, encapsulated by the way you're presenting it. The idea is to make the material come alive, give it some intrigue, and, and with each step, it's almost a beautiful lesson, the way you're being very, very purposeful with each movement. They will mimic that behavior. And what's beautiful about this material is many times a child's not ready to learn to tie their shoes because they don't have the fine motor control. And that's what all of the previous lessons in practical life are helping to develop. All of the spooning and the pinching and the pin poking, all of those lessons that seemed at the time not purposeful have a purpose. It's all about developing those muscles and that fine motor control so that they are prepared for lessons like the tying frame.